More than 50 million birds in this country have been infected in the last year with avian influenza. Wild birds carrying this lethal virus have spread it surprisingly to eight species of mammals and now to seals. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan visited Long Island's East End where ocean monitoring is now underway. Beachgoers on a glorious January afternoon on Long Island's East End have their eyes peeled for migrating seals from New England. Early winter around this time, uh, seals are traveling southbound to our waters. Recent seal deaths in the state of Maine have been linked to avian flu in an unusual mortality event. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration is notifying experts in our area. We have a lot of birds that just fly overhead. Um, it's very uh, contagious through tracking fecal matter or other animal fluids. The Long Island Aquarium in Riverhead and the New York Marine Research Center are carefully monitoring seals and beaches during foraging. If the seals are hauling out on the rocks and the gulls and wild birds are sitting there, there could be a potential transfer. Wild animal lovers who have been calling for rescues of cold stunned turtles are turning their attention to seals with caution. Do not touch a beached seal. Do not allow pets to approach one. There are stiff civil, even criminal penalties. It's required by the Marine Mammal Protection Act to stay at least 150 feet away to avoid causing stress to them and also to make sure that you protect yourself. Seals have been spotted recently returning to the ocean. Those staying beached are of concern and have been swabbed and tested, but as yet, no seals in our area have been infected with deadly and contagious avian flu. On Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News.